Hello and welcome to Taito Ecology. This is a, uh, a little simulation game where we're going to have an empty biodome. We're going to start with an empty, empty biodome. And we're going to uh, throw in things like plants and, uh, and animals like bunnies and foxes and worms and whatever. And we're going to try to create a balanced ecosystem uh, by, by uh, throwing all the animals in it. Ho hopefully they will, they will uh, interact the way we want them to. Uh, I picked this up on Steam. It came out yesterday. Um, let me just read the little info thing for you. Uh, in Taito Ecology, you have the power to create your own biodome and fill it with life. Start with an empty biodome as your canvas, then create a rich, diverse ecosystem by balancing producers, consumers, and decomposers. You're in control as you work to create a functioning ecosystem from the ground up. Uh, problem solving to learn life science principles. Eco simulation games, what it, what it calls itself. And uh, we have like 70 different plants and animals that we can throw in here. Anyways, let's play the game and, and figure it out. Uh, I've only just basically just gotten through this tutorial, and I'm going to do it again um, for this recording. So we have three choices. We can either choose a desert biome. We'll have like cactus and, and uh, what we can see here. Deserts are extremely hot and dry. Not necessarily hot. Uh, an ecosystem with plants and animals from the Mojave Desert in North America. We can do a rainforest, which will give us uh, like the Amazon. Okay. Or grassland will give me a home. A home where the buffalo roam. This is going to be uh, like the Great Plains. Well, this is where I live. So I don't want this. Let's do something creative. Uh, let's go with... Let's try the desert out. Not much rain, but it's going to be very hot. We'll have some, I don't know, snakes. We like snakes. We'll, try. we'll leave the tutorial on. That uh, helps ex kind, of ex Ooh. <laughs> kind of helps explain the game. All right. So the basis, I'm Albot. Welcome to Taito Taito Ecology. Here you can grow and maintain your very own ecosystem. This is your biodome. It looks pretty empty now, but don't worry. We'll be home to all sorts of plants and animals soon. Let's take a look around. Let's WASD to fly around. Flying around. Hold the shift key to move quickly. Ooh, we're kind of fast now. All right. Flying for a little while. Got it. We can zoom. Nope. Ready. Adding life. You're able to add many cool animals and plants to your biodome. You may, you will be able to unlock and learn about these species over time. Let's place down our first consumer. Consumer is an organism that gets its energy by eating plants or animals. Okay, first consumer. It's going to be this one. What do you... Okay. Put down a jackrabbit. Okay, where's the jackrabbit? Jackrabbit. Wink. We're going to place it there. I can't really zoom this thing very well. Place. And we now have bunnies. You have placed your first consumer territory. Animals will only move around within their territory. I've got try viewing the territory information by clicking on the territory marker. This. Oh, okay. Here we go. So we have we have healthy bunnies. They are they are very hungry bunnies because they have nothing to eat but sand. They uh, are are pooping not much. We have seven. Okay. Click one of jackrabbits. Oh, he's hungry. Biodex. Oh, this tells me all about jackrabbits. Uh, nearly every carnivore has them on the menu. That's good to know. They don't live very long or small. They reproduce like rabbits. Um, okay. Ready? Now we need a producer. Our jackrabbits are hungry. They need food. Okay. Uh, can we zoom out? Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is what we want. So we can kind of see our little plot here. Uh, okay, so you want some food, bunnies. I'll give you a joint fur. I'm not sure what a joint fur is, but we're going to buy it and place it right there for you. It's Oh, it's like a little bush. Uh, that's kind of strange. Bunny is sleeping. We're going to buy... An, oh, we want to buy... Th put three of them out. Okay. One. All right. Achievement. All right. And number three. Yoink. There you go, bunnies. Bunnies like, like grass. Okay. Done. Place your first producers. Your jackrabbits should be... Uh, have... Be much less hungry now. Let's get to see if their hunger has improved. Let's let's see. Oh yes, it has. They're very, they're very, very good. They'll overpopulate soon without anything to control their growth. You need a predator. I know what a predator is. Oh, I earned Tyco coins, Taito coins, by getting an achievement. Earn these through weekly rewards and achievements. Okay. Now consumer icon, we're going to pick us out. What do you want me to get? A bobcat. Coral snakes, kangaroo rats. Check out all these honeybees. Neat. Um, I was messing around with the the um, gra grassland biome, and it looks different. 
Why can't I see? Where is the badgers? Antelope. What am I looking for? I'm looking for a bobcat. Where's the bobcat? Oh, in here. Bobcat. Did I miss it? I must have. Hello, bobcat. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Very first one. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, bobcats, we're going to put... I guess... Do we want to... We don't want to put them like, right in the middle. We'll put them over here on the edge. Okay. We now have bobcats. We now have a balanced ecosystem. With a predator around, prey animals will not overpopulate your ecosystem. Great job. Now that you have few, a few inhabitants in your about them, you be careful about detritus. Detritus is another word for waste. Dead leaves, bones, and poop. Too much will harm everything in your ecosystem. Decomposers come in. Decomposers, yeah. We know what decomposers do. So we're going to go grab some mushrooms. Is that what you want? Mushrooms. Near the jackrabbit territory. So yeah, we'll plop them down right... Right there. Yes. Alright, my decomposers will consume some detritus every day, but only from the plants and animals within its territory. You can kind of see that ring there is my territory. But Iodome starts creating more detritus than your decomposers can handle. You need to add more decomposers, like millipedes. We now understand the basics of maintaining an ecosystem. With all three elements, producers, consumers, and decomposers. We can speed up. Okay. This is the average health of everything in your biodome, 99%. Excellent. Uh, name our di biodome. This is going to be the uh, Nook Reome. Nook Reome. Right. Take a picture of your ecosystem at any time using the photo view. All photos you take of your ecosystem will be saved in your computer's photo library. All right. right. All the way into enter camera mode. Oh, look at that. Okay. Um, let's take a picture of the of the bunnies. Uh, how do I? How do I? Uh, side to side. There we go. You wink. Yay. Okay. Now we're back in owl bot mode, and now we're way out. Okay. Whoops, I skipped that. I didn't read. What did that say? Ugh, I, don't know. I think I'm I'm on my own now. Is what that said. Okay, so we've got some plants. We need, um, I think what we need next is a pollinator. I'm going to play some pollinator. I think that's what actually it wants me to do. Pollinator we're going to throw right here. Wink. Yes. Okay, so we have mods. Mods, however, cannot pollinate these, I don't think. Oh, yeah, they can. I don't know. Very good. We have gone one day. What is this? Oh, we're in zone one, and we can buy more zones as time goes on, but we're not going to do that just yet. Oh, we can buy fish? Oh, there is a lake over here. Check that out, and we could get fish. Oh, okay. Two days have gone by. Things seem to be going okay. How do the rabbits feel? Rabbits? Rabbits are good. Mushrooms? Are you happy, mushrooms? Yes. Mushrooms are very happy. Uh, the coyote? Where is my... Or my bobcat? Where's my bobcat? Where is he? I don't see him over here. Apparently I have two of them. Are they, are they hunting rabbits? I should have put the bobcats on the hill. Oh, well. Oh, there they are. They're way over here. I see them. I see them. <laughs> is that so? Okay. Well, they're kind of hungry. Are you kind of hungry? Do you need more bunnies to eat? Um, how about I get you... Oh, ants. So we'll get ants whenever we... I guess when things start dying, we'll need to get some ants. Armadillos cost me ten of these things. We can also buy a creosote bush. Or a galetta grass. Or a beaver tail cactus. Yes. It costs fifteen, but it is worth it. Maybe. Probably not, but yes. Let's put our cactus right there. It interacts with everything. Yes, that's what we want. And we can look at it. Pollinates in 57 days. We have moths around, so that's okay. I'm not sure what the stasis means. Oh, it's in stasis. Then it'll move to flowering mode. Then it'll move to fruiting mode. Oh, okay. Sometimes this is, Oh, prickly pear. I know prickly pear. Small animals build dens at the base of these prickly pear for added protection from predators. So the bunnies will like those. 
Okay. Well, we can do ants. So we have these lots of energy points. These things. We can buy more of these kind of things. Uh, so we should. We can't buy anything new because we just squandered all of our tea points on, uh, on the cactus. But we can buy some ants. And I say we do it. Let's throw some ants. I guess we're just going to throw everything in the middle here. We'll put them over here by the, by the cactus. Oh, look. There's an anthill. Where's my ants? I don't see any ants. Can I, see, can I get closer? Oh, yeah, there they are. Place five animal territories in your biome. Try not to let them starve. Excellent. That's ten more points. We can buy something cool. Okay. We're on day four. We can buy another uh, armadillo. We can buy a coral snake. It's a carnivore, though. I don't think we want a carnivore. Oh, wait. We have ants. So now we need something to eat the ants. Which would be an armadillo. He's not my only insectivore. Ooh, I can buy pe I can buy bees. Deer mouse. These things are all expensive. Okay, so yeah, we'll stick with the armadillo. And we'll place him. Oh, he's got kind of a small range. We'll stick him right. He's gonna be by the ants. Oh, right there. Okay, ants are looking good. How's the rabbits looking? Rabbits are looking okay. They're a little hungry. I could probably put some more grass out. Mushrooms are doing good. Let's put a little more grass out. We have the energy points. Some, uh, oh, we can buy another one of these. Yeah. All right, there. Place it. Is that, is that Bobcat going to go chew on somebody? Oh, he's just tired. Oh, he's sleepy. Okay. Well, hey, have some grass. There you go. <laughs> okay. Uh, do we need more mushrooms, you think? Or maybe some millipedes. I can't afford the millipedes just yet. Can we see, like, a better readout of things? This is my map mode. Achievements. No, I don't have the ring. Yeah, okay. We can look at... That's where I just was. Um, I don't know how to see anything else that's like... How you doing? Other than this and clicking on people to make sure things are going okay. He's kind of hungry. But there's ants to eat. Do I maybe need more ants? Where are, where are my ants? They're, oh, they're over here. Oh, he's good. Oh, he goes down a little bit, then he goes back up once he finds an ant to chew on. I have 200 ants, so they seem to be going okay. The pollinators, are you guys uh, pollinating just fine? Oh, I get five gold per... Oh, there we go, here we go. My diversity score is four. Everyone is very healthy. Oh, I got the weak sauce achievement. And, okay. Um, oh, oh. Survivor Elite, 51 more of these, and you might have an achievement that's actually impressive. Thanks, game. Nothing like building me up. All right, so uh, we have some things we can buy more stuff. Um, I want, ooh, yeah, I want a snake. Snakes will go right here. Let's see him. Let's see him. There he is. How many do we get? We're gonna get four of them. Nice. Now, what do they eat? They are, they're carnivores, so they're going to chew on the bunnies. I guess, and the, the armadillos, too. Okay. If the kangaroo rat, we should probably buy, but we don't have the money for it. Or the bee, or anything else. So we could do more, uh, we could do more bunnies. Why not? We can never have too many bunnies in the world. Pop them down over there. Okay. What does this plus mean? Oh, I can spend money and get more of these. Oh, yeah. This, if I... Oh, it costs... Oh, 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 oh. I spend the, the teas for energy. I don't want that. I want the other way around. Are the snakes happy? Yes. He's chewing on things. We got mushrooms growing out here. 
Okay. Okay. Do we need... I think our mushrooms are okay. I think... Uh, let's just throw a little more grass out. More bushes. We'll throw some out here. There's, there's some animals hanging out out here. Stick one over here, too. Okay. And this is as fast as the game goes. Ooh, we can almost buy a tree. Well, not, not almost. It's 20. How come I don't get a different... Uh... It's strange that, like, with these, I get all kinds of... No, I don't even get those either. Like, with these guys, I get a whole uh, uh, detail of them. How come I only have three or four? Did, some, did one of them get chewed on? Maybe one of them died. Do I have a, a proper... I do have a proper scavenger, don't I? Yeah, the ants. Okay, so things will die. The ants will eat them. The, uh, the armadillos will come and eat the ants. I think we're in good shape. Okay, so the, the, the probably the coolest part of this game... This is obviously a very slow game. I mean, we've, gone, we've gone 10 days in this playthrough, and we're on the fastest speed. Well, what we can do is we can actually go out of the game... And if, say I, say I leave this game for a, a real-time week, I come back, and the game will have passed, you can see days of my specific, let's, let's, let's hang out here. We'll hang out, we'll check out a new biome real quick. No, I did, I did desert, didn't I? Oops. Alright, alright, alright. Let's do, we'll do a new biome, and we're going to pick Rainforest. Create a biome. We'll mess with this just a little bit, and then we'll go back. And then uh, this is going to be, I don't know, Am Amazon. We just play around with this just for a second. I'll throw out some ferns. Yoink. Place the fern. These T points carry over no matter what you've got. Place some of those, and we'll throw in uh, a goody. Okay. Uh, a goody bigger there. I don't like how the zoom works on this. It's a little strange. Oh, we have a little, like a little river over here. Okay. Uh, a goodie is in our... Okay, and we need... We didn't put any ants down. Mushrooms. We need something to chew on the agouti, which would be, in, I guess, an ocelot, which is only one point, so we will buy that. We can put him... He can hang out over here. Okay. So now, what we can do is we can go back... Go back to our main one, which was this one. Well, no time has passed. <laughs> well, if you let it go long enough, time will pass, and we're gonna just just check on our biome to make sure everything is running smoothly. So we can come back like weekly and check on this thing, and see how things are uh, are, are running. Kind of cool, I think. Obviously, a very kind of a uh, relaxing game. But eventually, you can get some pretty extravagant biomes. I'm I'm guessing. We can get some pretty cool looking trees in here. Agave, desert willow, a big tree. We certainly need some bigger trees. We can get some saguaro. Very cool. Joshua tree. I'm sad that, I'm sad there's only two different kinds of, of, uh, of detritus eaters. Um, uh, maybe, maybe more will unlock as we play the game. But we can get some turtles and we can get some antelope. Rattlesnakes. Oh, yeah. But uh, anyways, like we're gonna we're gonna put a cut here. So thanks for watching. I'll put a link to the uh, the game in in the description. It's it's on Steam. It's like I got it for six bucks. And uh, yeah, pretty fun little game. And we'll come back. I'll check on this maybe in a week. We'll come back and we'll check it out and see. Uh, we'll see how things have have uh, progressed. Right now we're at one hundred percent. Everyone seems to be in good shape. We only have nine bunnies around. I guess they're getting chewed on. I wonder if. No, the only thing eating anything around here is going to be the, the bobcat. The two bobcats are the only predators we have with all these animals. I guess that's okay, though. I think that's okay. We're going to find out here in a week if that's okay. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for watching. And uh, I will see you next time.